सो दिस इज द लास्ट टॉपिक ऑफ द चैप्टर नंबर वन विच इज रोमन न्यूमरल रोमन नंबर्स हेयर वी आर गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड दैन वॉट इज रोमन नंबर्स और वॉट आर रोमन न्यूमरल्स सो हेयर यू कैन सी द सिंपल नंबर वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव एट नाउ राइट द न्यूमरल्स इन नाइन एंड टेन सो दिस इज नाइन एंड दिस इज टेन वेन वी आर मूविंग टू द इलेवन ट्वेल्व वी विल यूज दिस टेन दिस नंबर दिस टेन एंड सेम वी आर यूजिंग द सिंपल वन एंड टू विद इट टेन वन इलेवन देन अगेन टेन 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 लाइक वी आर यूजिंग द नंबर्स इन 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 द सिंपल काउंटिंग दैट वन 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 एंड फिर वन टू थ्री सो टू थ्री फोर सो वी आर गोइंग टू यूज दिस नंबर नाउ आफ्टर नाइनटीन वी हैव टू मूव ऑन ट्वेंटी विच इज एक्स एंड एक्स सो दिस इज ट्वेंटी दिस ट्रिपल एक्स इज थर्टी and then triple after triple x we have 40 which is xl after xl we have l which is 50 lx 60 lxx 70 80 90 and 20 90 and 100 now you have to learn these and then you are going to solve the exercise Now move on to the exercise. Last worksheet of chapter number one, worksheet number five, Roman numerals. Here you have to write your name, class, and date. Here you have to match these numbers. If you have learned the Roman numerals from the textbook, then you are going to easily match these. Here you have to page number twenty one. Write the numbers in Roman numerals and write the Roman numerals in number. Double X is twenty. One and two is ten and eleven. Forty nine, L triple L sixty five, seventy four, eighty eight, and hundred. C is for hundred in Roman numeral. Next is page number twenty two. Here you have to think of the greatest and the smallest number which can be rounded to the nearest eighty five thousand five hundred. So here you can see I have write the number here and here. Now, after completing the chapter, we have the review, which is from the whole chapter that we have learned. Write in figure thirty-five thousand sixty, thirty-five thousand and sixty. We don't have any hundred here, so we are going to add zero. So three five zero six zero. Then we have to write. Now, eighty thousand. You are going to write here eighty. Then three hundred eight. We don't have any number of ten here, so we are going to write zero. So as you can see, eighty three zero eight. Now write in words. Here you have to write these numbers into in words or into spellings. Fourteen thousand three hundred and fifty six, sixty thousand and twenty. Here you have to find out the digit seven stands for. First you have to write ones, tens, hundred. Thousand and ten thousand, so seven is stands for thousand, seven thousand, then hundred, five and nine hundred. Next page, which is page number twenty four. Again, you have to fill in the blanks. Arrange the numbers in increasing order means from the lowest to the highest. Arrange the numbers from decreasing order means from the highest to the lowest. Circle the greater number in Roman numeral. Complete the number pattern. Then, page number twenty-five, which is fill in the blanks with the round off. Here you have to round off to the nearest ten. Here you have to round off to the nearest hundred, and here thousand. Here you have to round off to the nearest ten. You have to round off all these numbers to the nearest ten. Fifty-three. You are going to check three. I have given you the trick. Zero, one, two, three, four. And five, six, seven, eight, nine. So if the number is from these, so you are going to lower, and if the number is from these, you are going to upper. So you can see we have three. So it means we are going to lower number, which is fifty. So you are using this method, and then complete this. 
last page page number 26 of chapter number one here you have to round off to the number round the number here you have to round off to the hundred these numbers hundred and here you have to round off to these numbers into thousand so this is your chapter number one book 4a hope you understand thank you